right, welcome to the blog for Wednesday. All right, let's get right to the point. Magic, big victory last night over the Miami Heat. Emotional for everybody involved. But the moment of the night came after the game when reporters stuck the microphones in Dwight Howard's face. And he proceeds to say that the Magic should, quote, roll the dice and let him continue to play for the team and finish out the season because he feels that they've got a great opportunity here and they could go deep in the playoffs, blah, 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 blah. He wants to bring a championship to this city and all that stuff that we've heard so many times before. Roll the dice? Are you insane? Yeah, a multi-million dollar organization that uh, an entire region has its hopes pinned on. Roll the dice and hope that you decide to stay based on probably however the Magic perform in the playoffs, Dwight. Come on, man. Your age is showing right now. Your immature age. In fact, I think you're coming across as being quite selfish here because you want the best of both worlds. Should the Magic uh, buck the trend and be able to go way deep into the playoffs, and God knows, maybe even win a championship, then you can come off as not being a bad guy. You stay in Orlando. Everybody's happy, hugs, and goes home. But... If the more likely scenario pans out, the Magic go into the playoffs, get knocked out in the first or second round, then you can say the old line, I gave it my all, I put every effort into it that I could, but I'm sorry, I'm leaving. And then you leave the team with absolutely nothing. You go to the new uh, Brooklyn Nets, who don't have to uh, gut their team with a trade by the deadline, and you walk into a great situation. You're trying to have it both ways. I'm sorry, man. I, for one, I'm on the record right now, right this second, saying quit being so selfish. It's ridiculous. And I think the Magic need to trade you because I believe you've already got your mind made up. We'll catch you on here after at 3 o'clock. God knows the scenario could change before 3, and if it does, oh, well, at least I'm on the record. <laughs> See you later.